If you want to hunt werewolves, it's best at night by the light of a bonfire. And if you want to shoot them, forget silver bullets. Try a camera instead. That's what Danielle Levitt is doing. I photograph people in their spaces. The New York fine art photographer is chronicling the teen wolves of San Antonio for a British magazine. The UK, it seems, can't get enough of the canine. They appreciate youth culture in the same way, and they love the story. And they, I sent them the YouTube video, the um, interview that was on Channel 5. And yes, they sometimes meet under a full moon. The video garnered more than two million internet hits, giving the Crimson Blood Wolf Pack a much larger audience than the local San Antonio mall scene. I was surprised it was interesting. I wasn't expecting it to like, get that big at all. You're right. Yeah, there you go. And do but it did. For Wolfie Blackheart and her friends, the attention means a cover shoot, complete with hair and makeup artists, and their story to tell, from the deep woods to the open culverts of the west side. I'm taking a picture of a group of kids, and I want you to understand who these kids are without reading about them, because there are no words, they're strictly visuals. You look incredible. Levitt is no stranger to strangeness among teenagers. She's been snapping photos of teen culture for years. Levitt says the idea is to capture the inner strengths and vulnerabilities of her subjects. I'm not sure that they all have the fortune of coming from homes that they're excited about or have been nurturing. And what this has done is given them an opportunity to be nurtured and to be loved. And if her teen subjects think they've got a little lupus in them, she wants that to come out in her photos, literally. Their dedication to telling everybody who they are is, yeah, it's compelling. And how they use their tales and how their style helps tell their story, totally interesting. Some members of the Wolfpack find the addition of claws, hair, and pointed ears a bit gimmicky. But then again, they're already wearing those telltale signs. It's about seeing them move and actually um, engage. Tales that got them worldwide attention to begin with. It's gotten really big. It was like when I was like 11, six of us and my cousin used to lead it. From then, look at it now, like spread all over the internet and everything. It's just like a brotherhood. Joe Conger, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News.